Who wears the pants? Like, probably me. I'm still, no, I, I don't know. want to wear pants. I'm trying to break gender norms. Who do you think's more attractive? This kid is ugly. Oh, wait, sorry. Hey, what's up? Hi. Hey. Nope. Yeah. Nice. So today, you what are you laughing, bro? No, Kay. keep going. Today I'm I'm gonna be asking my ex girlfriend my home a few questions. He still doesn't know how to say my name. My home. Yep. He still doesn't know how to say. My, <laughs> my home. I'm asking That's my so ex. Awkward. Bro, I'm asking my ex girlfriend my home a few questions. Uh, we broke up like she or she broke up with me like she <laughs> <laughs> She broke up with me Bro, you start, start laughing. So wait, am I not allowed to laugh? No, you're allowed to laugh. Okay she, bro <laughs> she, okay. she broke up with me two months ago. So we're gonna ask some questions Right, but first we're gonna do a handshake. We just did it. No, I gotta do it again That's Smash that subscribe button Sm Smash that like button Smash that like button Oh, uh, mom, John what, tell us about yourself. Um, I'm a senior in high school. I like to watch movies. Watch movies. <laughs> hey, watch movies. Oh, I'm going to Tulane next Tulane, week. Tulane, let's go! Big dogs, go crazy. Her dad's name is Porta. Mm -mm. Porta John. <laughs> That's funny. This is my birthday. <laughs> <laughs> He acts like he's so <laughs> mature, and then he like is biggest. She's also an artist, bro. Go follow Malhome two two four. One, she's one of the best artists in the tri-state Milwaukee tri-state area. Also, what's your Snapchat? No, we're not giving. No, that. bro. No, okay. If you follow her on Instagram, Malhome John, the snap is in the bio, bro. We need her score to be at least a million by the end of this year. Run it up, bro, boys. Run it up. Facts about me. Um, they like know who you are. No, but I was gonna say a quick few quick facts. Okay. Uh, I like using smaller spoons for like when I eat like applesauce and like cereal and um, ice cream. What is the first thing? <laughs> what is the first thing you thought when you like met me? Um, I was like, this kid is f ugly. Oh wait, sorry. I'm not sorry. <laughs> you can swear. I can always leave it out. Um, <laughs> I was like, um, he. Okay, the first time I met Drew, I he invited me to his house on like a school night. So I was like, oh, maybe he doesn't care about school. So it's like a red flag right there. I walked in, Drew was like standing really like awkwardly for some reason, I'm gonna be honest. Like, I don't know what your like stance was. And then he was like, do you want a house tour? And I was like, okay, this kid is weird. So it's like, I was like, wow, like this kid just asked me if I wanted a house tour. <laughs> like, that, on like a Wednesday night. That was a nice thing to do. Was that bad or just was like that... imagine like never meeting someone and then he's like standing like this at the door and he's like, "Do you want a house tour?" Like it was oh. that type of scenario. But that was kind of nice and like it was that. I didn't. Nice? You didn't. You, there was like no commentary needed. You just asked for like. Are you not asking? Not oh asking. yeah, the first impressions of you. Just like, um, <laughs> it's just like an interrogation. I mean, I guess the, my first impressions of you were when I met you, bro. You like were taking your shoes off and you almost tripped. It's like you almost killed yourself. Like you just like took your shoe mm. off and it was like <laughs> you like almost fell and I was like and then you like made a joke you, you were like fu it, was, it was funny though what's one nice thing about each other to say to each other <laughs> you can go first you can go first Are you sure? yeah no go ahead oh I think uh I think you're super funny and you're one of the funniest girls I've ever met girls funny, funniest people I've ever met funniest girls <laughs> <laughs> funniest people I've met um I think Drew is <clears throat> he has good Dental hygiene. Thank you. <laughs> hey, okay. Good dental hygiene. Okay. Just, I think Drew is really hardworking, which is admirable. Appreciate it. <laughs> that was a hard for her to say that. Okay. Oh, he's up. <laughs> uh, okay. Who wears the pants? Like, probably me. I'm still cool. He's like I'm saying, still... guys, listen to me. Like, he thought he wore the pants. Like, I definitely did. And, like, I just, like, it's okay. That's fine. You can wear the pants. No, I, I don't. I don't want to wear pants. I'm trying to break gender norms. See, like, this shit <laughs> pulls is not funny at all. Like, I'm be honest. Bro, bro. I'm trying to break the gender norms. You're going to think I'm so mean. Break, like, I'm just break. sarcastic. What? Who carried more? The relationship more? Me. You? Why do you say that? 
I just think like you just like I don't know. Like I feel like you probably know why. Is that cryptic? No, I just like well Yeah, no, I think it's like you like I just like 62. Was more in stock. I think you sixty two percent, me thirty eight. Is that fair? Sixty two? I think that it's is a little more. No, no, no. What no did kidding. you do that was like so like you think it's more attractive? I think we're equal. Equal? I think you're like. You guys can decide. Yeah, you can decide. That's gonna be more easy. Attractive. Like, I think. I think she wins. You're like thirteen percent. What are these more. percentages? Like, what are these like numbers you're just coming up with? Is that okay? Sorry, that might be a little like on the low end, like sixteen, at least. No. Per what? More. No, I'm just saying like. No, I like, if I was like a, if I was, if I'm like a six point six, you're at, you're at least. 19% higher. What is What's the most annoying thing that I did? Um I wouldn't say like you're an annoying person, so it's not like What the fuck? <laughs> um I <laughs> I wouldn't say like you're like anything like is like super annoying. Like I wouldn't use that word. I think there's like some things that you do. I was like, well, okay, like it's kind of weird. No, like a, Which like is an unique, annoying. Unique. No, like weird. <laughs> Not okay. Bro, when I first started talking to you, I left you on red, bro. That was strategic. No, it wasn't because I was like, this, he doesn't like me anymore. That's not good. Uh, Don't that do bad? that. <laughs> I would that, not recommend doing that. That was bad? Yeah, what do you mean? Okay, I mean, I did pull through. Yeah. We're still dating too. No, we're not. I don't. Don't, <laughs> bro. What do you get away from me, bro? I don't. What, what went wrong? Or like, what was there? What went, yeah, what went wrong technically? That's actually the question I want to know. Like, what was it like that? Was there, like, there had to be like some trigger? And you never told me this. So I'm like interested. Is that a trigger? Like, it was just gradual. I think. I feel like you low key got infiltrated, like by like someone. No cap. Stop. I didn't get infiltrated. Like infiltrated, but like, I feel like someone was triggered. Like someone was like. On I don't your ass. think it was someone. I think it was just like I like realized, just like. Like what? Like what? Like just like one day you were like it slowly started creeping, and like one day you're just like, this guy, bro. I think like I knew probably. You knew like what? Like I like like a week before. A week before. And just simply like, then ultimately, why did we break up? Or why did you break up? We just talked about this. I know we did, but it just. But like, what was the general reason? I just think like it's there's different like layers to a relationship and it wasn't like every single like I think we would just be better as like I would rather have broken up with you and just be friends. Damn bro that's tough. She's on that friend zone type. Well we dated for like seven months so. Friend zone baby. Uh, you didn't get friend zone. I literally dated you. Okay. Hey, some? hey though. Keep this both of you though. That's that's okay. Are you not um, gonna, do you have no like response to this? To, wait, well, just the fact that, okay, so you said. No, like there's no like response. To that we'd be better. No, yeah, I think, I think we would honestly be better as friends. It was my first relationship, so that was, that was always good to learn and grow as a person. Uh, and uh, yeah, I think, I think we'd be better as friends, honestly. Keep it above 50. Yeah, it's just gonna be like, I'll be better as friends and he's just like madly in love with me, which I totally get. Do you have any questions? Were you like sad when we broke up? Mm, yeah, that's a good question. I think um, I think it was more sad that I was just like losing a like a you know like a best friend basically. <laughs> and so, no, I definitely I definitely was sad. I definitely was sad for for a little bit. Um, but also, I mean, you have to be appreciative of the, t of the good times we had. And like, I think overall it was the right decision for you. I think it's the, I think it would be a good decision. I mean, I guess we're friends now. So, what about you? Was I sad when we broke up? Yeah. Yeah. How like how long would you say? Like a few days. Well, few I don't like I was I was like sad that we weren't friends anymore. Yeah, that's fair. It was probably. Like, final word. Final thoughts. Um. This is good. This is good. Final thoughts. Um. Fun times with the homie. Talks. Um. First time seeing her. Good times. Uh, we're in ever. Talk, ever. First time seeing her in a while. Um, good stuff. Yeah.
Jesus Christ. <laughs> this is pretty much the worst video I ever made. You wanna like cover it like all like... Oh. <laughs>